I'm so sorry that I miss Wednesday's video. Um, I have been really, really busy, and I'm so sorry, you guys. Um, and we're still really busy. So, I am going to try to do this haul for you guys um, quick today. Um, I went to three different stores. Um, one, this right here is the Dollar Tree. This in the middle is Walmart, and that over there is Aldi's. Um, my dad came to visit this week and work has been super busy and, um, we still got some family stuff going on. So I am really sorry, you guys, but I'm so grateful, um, that you guys, um, are still continuously supporting me. Um, so thank you guys for everything. I really, 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 really appreciate it. Um, and I will try my best to do better. Um, I do want to do an update video, um, as well as I've got another exciting, um, monthly video, so I'm excited about that. Hopefully I'll be able to record those and get those up soon for you guys, um, to try to make up for Wednesday. I'm so sorry. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get into it. Um, so this is from the Dollar Tree. I picked up some more of these chicken patties. Um, we have... This is my second time buying them. My husband really liked them last time. And I just, um, you know, put them in the oven, put some cheese on them, and have them for lunch. So that's that. Um, I got Bam some more long grain rice for his dinner. And then some pinto beans. Uh, funny story about this. So I have never bought or used bagged beans, like dry beans. And I had no idea that you had to soak them first, so I cooked them and they were like rock hard and Bam would not eat them. So I'm going to try again and actually soak them this time. So, so who doesn't love Easter goodness? And these are the little um, Omer's little double crisp things. I remember these as a little kid. When I was on the Dollar Tree, I was like, I have to get some. So I picked up those. Um... Then I got some spicy sausage. I'm going to make smoked sausage and potato bake. Um, we had that before and my husband really liked it. And then I needed a new little scrub brush for our dishes. Um, so yeah, I just got that and I think you put the soap in there. Pretty, um, pretty stiff brush so I think this one will be good and last a while. Then I picked up some more body wash. Um, I love this lavender chamomile. I just love lavender, you guys. Um, so I picked up some more of that. I got some Brillo pads and these, um, obviously, so I can clean um, our dishes in the stove. And then I got this little nifty binder thing, if I can get it open with one hand. Um, I'm going to put... I started making my mom's cakes, and so... I'm going to put um, little recipe cards um, since obviously she has the originals. Um, but I'm going to use that for that. And then this, we've got some documents that I want to keep together um, that are probably going to be needing. Um, so I just picked up this little windowed envelope for that. And then that is all for the Dollar Tree. So then at Walmart... I got my husband's favorite pizza, the Sam's Choice Philly Cheesesteak. If you guys have not tried this, it's really, really good. Um, and they normally, I think, are $5.97, and they were $3.97 this week. So I got two, and they're usually always out because they're popular. So I got two of the Philly Cheesesteak, and then I got one of the um, Chicken Buffalo um, for his lunches, and then maybe for like one dinner three a week. I got a um, bag of frozen whole strawberries. I'm about to make a strawberry cake, so I need that for that. Those were $2.25. Um, last time I got some detergent from the Dollar Tree, and it was not very good. Um, and, you know, sometimes you win, sometimes you lose, guys. So I had to go back to the Ajax, and I believe this was $2.96. But it lasts a long time. Like the bottle at the Dollar Tree that's almost the size lasted maybe a month. I probably will get two, maybe three months, maybe more out of this one. Um, so I got that. Went over a little bit this week because we had to buy some um, 
expensive toiletries this week, you guys. Um, so I got these um, Venus razors. I really like this brand. These were eight dollars and I think forty-seven cents. So it was expensive. Um, all of my mascara, even my samples, are completely out. So I got some Rimmel London. I really like this brand as well, and I haven't seen this um, scandalous scandal eyes rocking curls before. Looks very interesting. So got that. I think that was five dollars and uh, forty-seven cents or something like that. Then we were out of little pods for our dishwasher, and these are uh, eight dollars and ninety-seven cents for forty-four of them. Um, which I know that I can get them cheaper, um, but this brand works really well, um, and I just uh, haven't found one that works as well as that, even the off-brand. But maybe, maybe you guys know. Um, so then I just got a 35 pack of water. This was $3.50. Um, I had to pick up some um, freezer bags. These were $5.43. And then some more. One's freezer, one's gallon. So they're about $5.43. Um, so that was kind of expensive as well. And then I got this Moist Supreme um, Classic White Cake Mix. This is for my strawberry cake. Confection sugar for my strawberry cake, gelatin, um, cream cheese, and then my husband's beloved root beer. I normally just get a six pack, but you guys, he would drink this breakfast morning, uh, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So I got him an extra one this week, and those are three thirty three a piece. And then the last little bit that I got from Walmart. Um, Bam and Harley always get treats um, when they get locked in their crate at night. So I got this 25 ounces. This will last me at least a month, and this was $3.98. And then I got some munchy bones for them. This was $5.50. I also picked up some hot dog buns. Um, we we're going to have hot dogs this week. So that was 98 cents and some hamburger buns to go with our chicken patties over there. And I'm also going to make some hamburgers. That was 98 cents as well. And then that is all for Walmart. Um, and then at Aldi's, I got some sharp cheddar. This was $2.79. I'm going to make tacos this week and taco soup. Um, sounds like I'm tacoed out. Um, and then I'll use some of this for my salad as well. And for the uh, sausage potato bake. Um, then I got some baby spinach. I'm going to use this for um, salads through the week for my lunch. Um, I don't remember how much that was. I want to say it was 2 or $3. And then I got some croutons for my salad as well. And then I love these, you guys, at Aldi's. These are so good. And there was only one of them where I would have gotten more. But these chewy rainbow chip granola bars... These are really good. They're $1.79 and you get 10 of them, so that's not bad. Then I got some light red kidney beans for my taco soup, which I couldn't remember the recipe, so I'm, hope, I'm hoping that's what's going in it. Um, and then black beans for my taco soup as well. And then some pasta sauce for my um, taco soup. And I'm supposed to make either spaghetti or lasagna, so I'll use some of that for that. Then I got some Pop Tarts. Um, these were $2.79. And when I went to Walmart um, today, they had them for $3.69. So definitely a better deal and still the same brand um, at Aldi's. That's for breakfast. Got some brown gravy. We're going to have Salisbury steak this week. Um, and then I got some zesty Italian dressing for my salad. And then the last thing some ground turkey, um, Salisbury steak, hamburgers. Um, tacos, taco soup, pretty much for everything we're making this week. Um, and I've got one more in the freezer. And this will last probably two meals, maybe. Um, so, yeah. That is what I got this week. Um, so, yeah. Hopefully, like I said, I will be able to um, record and upload um, some more videos or at least one more um, before Wednesday and yeah I just want to thank you guys for watching I'm sorry I am not showing my face today I am not feeling good and I do not look good so 
Anyways, you guys, I hope y'all have a good weekend, and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.